Sissy fam, it's Eileen, your independent Sissy consultant girl. Today, we got double club. Yep, we got a double club. This was my club for October. It did come a little late, um, I think because we had our flash sale and like the shipping and all that good stuff. But first, I hope Everyone had a very spectacular Halloween. Everybody was safe. They got their candy. They went trick-or-treating. They did their partying. Whatever. Girl, I did a clown makeup for a little party that we went to. Kids were happy on Halloween, but happy November. Did you guys hear that? November. This year is almost over. 2022, we will be saying goodbye soon. So what happens in November in Scentsyland? Number one, new whiff box. New whiff box came out November 1st. New scent and warmer of the month. I will put a picture up here. Amazing. I'm loving the little snowman. Another thing that came out November 1st, we have new uh, warmers and new bundles for the whole month. If you guys don't know, it's been for a while now. Every uh, new month, we're getting new warmers that come with a bundle of wax for free. It's amazing. And then Frida Kahlo is available now on my website. I think we're celebrating, if I'm not mistaken, at our end of the month live, Mexico is like turning like 10 years for Scentsy. I guess they've been selling there for 10 years and they decided to get the licensing to do a Frito Kahlo warmer and it's absolutely stunning. I'm loving it. I'm loving that they are embracing the Hispanic culture. I, I absolutely love it. She is available. And there's one more thing that I can't remember. Oh my God, girl, November 7th. Snow White is hitting the website November 7th. It's a Monday around 10 a.m. I will put pictures up here. Snow White is getting her own warmer and her own scent. What I'm loving about this warmer, it is the Wishing Well. We always visit the Wishing Well at Disneyland. Absolutely in love. And I think like they were talking about, it is an element warmer. The dish replicates the wishing well. It is absolutely so cute. I'm definitely picking up that one. Also, happy Dios de los Muertos to my Hispanic culture that celebrates it this year. I don't think we're, we're doing it, but if you guys celebrated it, happy Dios de los Muertos. I hope your friends were beautiful, and I hope you all got together and had an amazing time with your families. That's it. Let's get into club. I have my monthly and my quarterly, and we'll start off with my little monthly one. And this one's tiny. I had to really, really cut down both of my clubs. Girl, I got so much wax that it is absolutely freaking ridiculous, okay? Wax is coming out everywhere. Y'all can bury me in my own wax because there's a lot, but I do, girl, I do enjoy my wax and I, uh, it has to come down to my absolute faith now. It just has to. So is what it is. Girl, what I got in my club, what I love that we can do with our club. It's not only for wax. Girl, I needed bulbs and I didn't have to do a whole order and pay like the $10 shipping for bulbs. I instead, Scentsy Club is, um, Eight bucks. If you guys don't know what Scentsy Club is, it is a subscription service that you can put all your consumable products in that is on your schedule. You can either get it monthly, bi-monthly, or quarterly, and you put the consumables that you need in your club. And for US and Canada, they just, no matter what the cost of your Scentsy Club is, there's no more $10 shipping. It's a flat eight bucks. So like when I need my counter clean, my light bulbs or whatever, and I know my club is coming up, I just put it in my club instead of making a whole order and paying um, all the shipping. So we got 25 watt light bulbs and the rest, girl, it's wax. It, it is what it is. It's always going to be wax because I love wax. I love my house smelling amazing. So I get wax and I have to be super, super picky. And I'm also thinking about combining these two clubs. So just maybe getting one that's just quarterly. I don't really know yet what I'm doing with my life, but again, a lot of stuff got cut. This is a small monthly club. We got Snuggle Up from the Catching Z's collection. I believe this came out 2021, January 2021. This is absolutely beautiful. It's like a laundry cotton lavendery scent and 
it it does it it's because it's that lavender it smells like nighttime and i meditate i love it ocean i have so many bars of ocean but i'm getting through them all um now i'm down to my bars that are actually blue and not green i love it it's a wonderful fresh scent i did put alice in wonderland and she stayed in my club and i think she's no longer available i don't know but i love this this is oh, so monsters ink vibes it is like lemon with berries with fizz with freshness it's absolutely beautiful we're all mad here love it moana she's my favorite you guys you know she's watermelon lay and pineapple and she's beautiful. She's a wonderful, wonderful performer. Wonderful performer. So from the vitamin collection, girl, I get three of them. Um, vitamin R, vitamin U, and vitamin M. I meditate to all of these and I absolutely love them. They're all great performers for what it is, for meditation. I don't suggest putting these like in a bathroom. Don't think like they're room filling. They're made to be light and I love them so they're not they're no longer available but they're good Kahiko Hula you want your house to smell like Hawaii you gotta get yourself oh my god some Kahiko Hula it's the papaya that I absolutely love in this now what I did was um I ended up loving this scent you guys <laughs> the hocus pocus scent um I smelled this at SFR and I hated it. I was like, this is gross. It smells like elixiry, potiony. No, not in my house. It don't. It smells like vanilla and like dark berries. And I love it. In fact, um, Halloween. This came out for Halloween for me. I put it all in my warmers and I loved it. Oh, so it's in my club and I think this is already gone. I want to say this is already, um, I think it's already put back in the vault. I think. Don't quote me because I really don't know. And last up is Sunburst Bamboo. My absolute favorite for meditate for meditation. Um, between this and Snuggle Up, they're like they're like tied for like number one. I absolutely love it. This is so fresh, so tranquil, so like spa, just beautiful and calming, and I absolutely love it. So that is my monthly club. We have how many items here, girl? We got eleven. So we got ten bars and I ended up getting light bulbs because either my customers get them from me or girl I change my bulbs is what it is so 11 bars and light bulbs for my monthly and with your club you guys you guys can change it as often as you want I used to change mine daily now I can go like a couple weeks and then figure out what I need but I have to remember that my club is there and now we have our quarterly which my quarterly Quarterly was out of freaking control. You guys, it was out of control. So I had to really, really narrow it down. And girl, we are down to 20 items. So it's double what my uh, monthly club is. So I get 10 bars here plus one. That's which is 11, and I get 20. And I want to say this is all wax. Okay, I wanted to say it's all wax. It is what it is. But I go through wax like crazy. If you guys see my empties what i've been warming you guys know i go through so many bars so i think my clubs are justifiable for me but i did like i said narrow them down and right off the bat you guys we got a brick <laughs> we got a brick because we love bricks here this is one of my favorite favorite scents that um i think this will be about my third brick i'm going through of this because I love it that much. It is vanilla bean butter cream. This now, I just did a video of Sense of the Season and I told you guys they did a whole vanilla bean butter cream twist on that. And it's based on this beloved scent. And I told you guys in that video, it comes in a brick. And I love it and I wanna say, oh girl, she's sweaty already. Hi, a girl. But it's beautiful. This is a wonderful mixer. It's great on its own. If this would ever leave the catalog, you guys, it is going in my club. I love it that much. I go through it by the brick. I think that I want to say this is my third or fourth brick that I'm on with it. It is what it is, girl. I absolutely love it. So I'll take some out. 
and I want to say my club's already been I mess with my club all the time you guys it's absolutely ridiculous but I, I have to it's only the ones I absolutely need that's my mentality right now who knows who knows so first up vanilla mint vanilla mint did not come back this year in the fall winter catalog this is like ice citrus and vanilla with mint and this is so beautiful. It's available in the counter clean. I've been using it in the counter clean and I absolutely love it. I think it comes in the bathroom cleaner as well. I don't know. It might come in dish soap. Girl, usually when they bring it out, they fully bring it out. This is amazing. This is beautiful and I love it in wax. I hate cinnamon. I hate cinnamon, but I love this scent. This is the evil queen. It's apple and cinnamon. And this is the cinnamon I can do. This is absolutely, girl, she all sweaty too. Um, this is the cinnamon I can do because it's more of a bakery cinnamon, but can this get out of hand? Absolutely, because it's cinnamon, but it's the cinnamon I love. Sugar. I don't know if I still need sugar in my club. I had so many cotton candy scent. Oh my God, this has lemon drops. This is like, oh my God. God, it smells pink and lemon and it's absolutely beautiful. It is not the world's best performer. It's a good medium performer, but I love it in my kitchen and it smells like cotton candy with lemon drops. Dumbo, Dumbo will not be leaving my club. I absolutely love Dumbo. It is, oh my God, like some kind of clementine with peach nectar, vanilla, very smooth. This is a wonderful, amazing performer. My kids love it. I love it. It, it stinks. What I'm going to be warming a lot of is uh, Disney's The Haunted Mansion. I absolutely love this. This really, because this is like a light beige. This is like absolutely clear in my warmers. I don't even see that when I'm warming it. I love it. It smells like gingerbread to me. Uh, it is bakery with a hint of ginger and bread. And this is what I smell when I'm on the ride. When you're going through the ride at Disneyland. Oh my god, you um, go through the scene of the dining room hall where they're having like their ghost party and dinner and all that and you smell gingerbread and this is this is exactly what I think you smell. Sea salt and avocado left the catalog so it went in my club. Even though it's still available in brick, we don't know when they change the bricks or if they are going to change the bricks or if they're adding to the bricks, but sea salt and avocado I need it in a bar just in case they take away the brick because I don't I go through bricks I don't have like a time schedule on it so it's when they're done they're done and I don't know if they ever bring it back so we have the mando I absolutely love this scent it took me a while to to get on it's a beautiful like minty green um it's like silver mint and tea and Lord knows what else is in there. There's like lavender, who knows? I don't know, there's all kinds of scents. It smells really good. It's a very fresh green scent and I love it. Um, peachy and palm trees, I love this. This was the summer collection this year. This is a great performer. Great, great performer. This is such fresh, juicy, like peach with like palm tree or something, I don't know. But girl, this smells absolutely delicious and I love it. We have a Poor Unfortunate Souls Ursula. This came out with the Villains Collection like two years ago. I want to say in 2020 we got these. And then it comes back and then it goes away and it comes back. And I love this. This is like goji berry. And like sea mist. I smell like sea mist. And it smells like really, really good. I'm the only one who really, really loves this scent. And that's why it stays with me. But I absolutely love it. She's a good performer. I put her in my bathroom and nobody complains. But if I put her in a room, people complain. But nobody complains in the bathroom. So it is what it is. She stays in my club. So, love and happiness from last spring back my bar. I love this. I cannot get enough of it. I only warm it in my room. Oh, it's so beautiful. It's so cozy cardigan vibes. Just a little bit deeper. A little bit. Oh, beautiful. It's just so beautiful. It's a beautiful pink wax. Beautiful. And I love it. And I think this one is probably the only one that stayed from the bring back my bar because I did fall in love with it. It's such a beautiful room scent. Best in Snow, you guys, did not return from this catalog as well. And it's my fresh scents that I love. This one in Vanilla Mint, I will never get rid of. And I think I loved it since 2020. And I just, I needed them in my life and they're still here. Okay. I don't know if this is coming back. It's just staying in my club for right now. I don't know if it's still in my club, but I, I needed a bar of it. 
I don't know if Scentsy is bringing this back next year and I just had a feeling they might not. Pineapple Pucker. I like Pineapple Pucker. Pineapple Pucker. Why I think this may not come back, a lot of people, which I was one of them, that raved and raved about Pineapple Mango. And Pineapple Mango was amazing. So I'm afraid they might take this out. And this smells just like Dole Whip from Disneyland. It is sweet. It is tart. It is pure Dole Pineapple to me. And it reminds me of Dole Whip. And if they didn't bring it back, I probably would kick myself in the butt if I didn't have a few bars of these. So Pineapple Pucker is in my club for right now, just in case it doesn't come back for spring, summer. It might, I don't know, girl. I don't have all the inside knowledge to Scentsy. Lemon Cake Drizzle, I love this. It smells like Lemon Loaf from Starbs. Oh my God, and it's a good performer. And it smells like Lemon Loaf Cake. More like, yeah, like Lemon Loaf. Oh, it smells so good. It has the icing on it and I love it. And it's in there for right now. We'll see what's happening. My club has, oh, I can't get through all the wax, girl. And then we get early access to things as consultants. And girl, I'm buying and buying wax. I'm buying and buying bricks, girl. It, it, something has got to give. So it is, it is what it is. Girl, I got another sea salt and avocado. Did I put two freaking bars of sea salt and avocado in my club? Oh, look at that, I did. <laughs> There's only meant to be one bar, but I put two. It's all right, I go through this uh, during the, the spring and summer. I go through sea salt and avocado like nobody's freaking business. So, make a splash. Um, I think it's going to come back, okay? I think it's going to come back. But just in case, I love this one so much. This one I warm like crazy too. It's so just aquatic and fresh. And this was my combo that I love. So that's why these two are in here. I took out Plumeria Peach because I ended up loving Peachy Palm Trees more. So this is the combo that I love to warm that nobody complains about. And it's my favorite. So that's why that's in there. We have Coffee Tree, which I need to start warming coffee tree. I have a lot of bars of this because it's been in my club for a long time since, I don't know, like two or three bring back my bars ago. And I love to mix this with pumpkin. So I just haven't done it yet. We are finally cold, you guys. So all the stuff is coming out. All the stuff is just, it's all the warm stuff now I can start warming. So there's going to be, there's a lot of just warming that I have to do. So Maleficent. I don't warm her very often. I warm her with Monsters Inc. I don't have Monsters Inc. in my club. I don't get it as often, so she doesn't get as warmed as much either. But this is like supposed to be oh, plum and oh my god, some kind of flower. Not magnolia. Um, I don't remember. Oh, it's just some kind of flower, but it's more plum than anything. It's very plum heavy, and I love it. She's absolutely fresh plum. Oh, Cotton Candy Cookie made it. This, These were from the last Bring Back My Bars. Cotton Candy Cookie is absolutely beautiful, you guys. It is so bakery. Oh, it's like that, like, gooey sugar cookie. Not like fully baked sugar cookie. It's like gooey sugar cookie with cotton candy. And it's beautiful, and it's a wonderful performer. It's one of my favorites. And last up is Cutie Pie Cupcake, you guys. I've had Cutie Pie Cupcake in my club since 2020, I want to say. And I love it, because I think that's... So Cutie Pie Cupcake came back last Bring Back My Bar, but it also came back in 2020. Because it's a cult favorite. It keeps on getting voted back. And it's a little sweaty. But that's it. So that's 20 bars with two seeds, salt and avocado. I didn't need two seeds, salt and avocado, but it is what it is, you guys. And that is my monthly and my quarterly club. It's a lot of wax. I know it's a lot of wax. I love wax. And guys, I go through a lot of bricks and bars a month. And if you guys see my empties videos, you guys would know. So you guys, that's it. Let me know down below. What are you guys having in your club? What do you guys have? Maybe we have the same stuff. Let a girl know down below because I love to chit chat with you guys down below. And all your comments and all your advice always helps somebody else out besides me. So people read the comments and I love it. I love the little Scentsy fam that we have here and before you leave hit the like subscribe and turn on your notification bells and after all that since fam if you still want to hang around with me there's always a video here 
and I will see you guys on the next one. Bye, Cincy Man.